I'm on a Grandmaster mission to complete all of the combat achievements in Old School RuneScape. My adventure has taken me from the depths of the Inferno to the heights of the God Wars, but now only a few Grandmaster tasks remain. I want to finish what I started and become a Grandmaster of solo missions. <laughs> I've been absolutely terrible at completing raids. All these tasks have been waiting for me this entire time, and it's all going to lead up to the solo speedrunner. Oh, and look, for once, kill count does count. I've already done it. I've only ever done around 100 solo raids, and that was on my hardcore Iron Man with terrible gear. If I'm going for this solo speedrun time, I need to learn the mechanics of all these bosses the right way. And luckily for me, there's a master task in each boss room, which basically teaches me to solo raid. Come on, I've done it. Yes. The Phoenix Necklace coming in clutch. I'm not going to be killing the Rangers and Mages in my solos. For my speed run, I'll be prioritizing the fastest bosses. Tecton is one of those, so it's important I get this down. And for this task, I need to take no damage. We're done. Yes. <gasps> what? There's nowhere. I just failed the blind spot because I ran underneath it. How is that even a thing? I swear I watch people do solo raids and they just make everything look so easy, man. How am I getting hit an 18? <laughs> What's going on at 20? I'm supposed to redemption this. I'm obviously doing something wrong. What a time to be alive. You don't actually have to be good at anything. You can just copy people off YouTube guides. Vespula is another very fast room, so I'm always going to be doing this. I then finished off the rest of my mechanical masters and set out on my speed run. No, I nearly made it without prepping. 24 hit points left. Yeah, this is a speed run, by the way. <laughs> I made it just under 30 minutes, and the Grandmaster time is 17 minutes, so I have to be 13 minutes faster. Wow. Before I take on the Grandmaster speed run, I'm going to clean up some of the master tasks. I have to do the perfect ohm, which means I basically don't get hit by anything. I can't take damage from any specials, and the answer to that that I've come up with is... Just never get hit by the boss. I'm doing four to zero the whole time. Oh my, I'm an idiot. I just killed the mage hand. <laughs> what am I doing? Wait, did it tell me I failed this task? No. Oh, we're good to go. Let's go. Please tell me that was perfection. A little pop up above my head on the screen. No? Oh, okay. Perfect. I also have to get 40,000 points in one raid. And for that, I turned on the big raid scouting outside and got myself a double tightrope raid. Nearly 23k points before going into home. That is almost what you get on a normal solo. And that's it. I'm putting it on the line. Perfect ohm trio. The same as perfect ohm solo, but I have to come with two of my friends also known as my alt account. I've scaled this raid up to three and I'm doing it alone because I don't know what's worse, me failing in front of other people and letting them down or them failing and letting me down and me getting annoyed at them. I don't want either, so I'm literally killing Ohm with three times the stats. Hopefully this goes fine. I'm doing such a slow method here. We're doing one to zero on the melee hand, just hitting it, running back and never taking any damage. Please don't say I just wasted an hour of my time. Yes! We're done. Perfect own true. And all my little noob accounts got the task as well. Nice. It's time to go for the time. The solo speedrunner combat achievement. 17 minutes. It's probably the most difficult task I've gone for so far based on my raiding experience. This is going to be a journey. Another day in the ghetto. But look outside and I'm already upset, yo. It looked about 102. It's a Saturday and Biggie ain't got nothing to do. Uh, I'm interrupted by a phone ring. Sometimes I wish I never got the motherfucking thing. Hello, hello, can I speak to Biggie? Yo, who that's Donnie, sir? Yo, call back, I'm busy. Bro, 11 minutes down to Ohm, I definitely could save some time there, but my main concern right now is I've only got two brews and I'm not going to prep any potions. And I didn't make it. I made it to head phase. That was rough. This is going to be difficult to do this without prepping. Yay, new PB, 24 minutes. Only seven minutes off the time. That was better. Oh, nearly the sub 20. Nice. Oh, I got a master task as well, the speed chaser. Okay, so only the grandmaster speed task to go now. 19 minutes, we're rapid. I did a slightly different layout this time and I got some new tasks, Undying Raider. Um, yeah, uh, don't worry about that one. Have I really not done a raid without dying yet? All right, I'm ready to take out the fastest layout possible. Vaza, Tecton, Vespula with a rope and crabs. This sells for anywhere from three to five mil. They're very valuable because they're so rare to find. I'm really embracing the speed run strats now. I've got Phoenix necklace on so I can spam click the boss and I'll be able to hit it straight away. Bang, and my hit points is straight up to 33, the perfect start. There she goes, 17 minutes. I can't even make it with the perfect layout. 18, 28. 
Big PB, one minute 28 to knock off now. So people scout raids and sell them for GP, and I'm spending quite a lot of money buying the fastest layouts in Discords right now. But even with several people scouting, the best layouts don't come up too often, so it can be frustrating. Are you serious? No, I didn't pick up the fucking stone. And that's how you waste five mil in two minutes. Purple, come on. I think loads of the raids loops are bad these days. Let's get some money. Oh, that's actually decent, I hope. How much is that? 66 mil. Okay, that pays for all my scouting services. Oh my god, I'm so close. 17 minutes and 100 hit points left. 19 seconds over. I can definitely do this. <laughs> Are you actually joking me? Oh, welcome to Solo Raid, for fuck's sake. Yes, I beat it. The Grandmaster Solo Speedrunner 1616. I absolutely crushed it. What the hell? We went so fast that raid. I'm so happy with that. I then got carried in a trio by Sensei Rice Cup, who is also going for Grandmaster. I, I stand next to it. Stand on it. Wait, <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I actually, tr I actually trust you as well. It actually looks so good, all three people running the mage hand at once. And we completely smashed the three-man Grandmaster task by over a minute and a half. But this video is about solo missions, so less of this teaming nonsense. If you don't subscribe to this channel right now, there are going to be consequences. But I'm sure you'll make the right decision. One of the solo tasks I gave up on was the Corrupted Gauntlet Grandmaster speed run time. It's 6 minutes 30, but if I want all the solo tasks, I have to come back and complete it. That was quick. That could even be it. Oh, never mind. 6.52. It's a new PB. I've got 22 seconds to shave off here. Wow, what a rare sight. That's the, uh, the kill count task done for the master tier of the diary. You can't really optimize the boss fight too much, apart from doing 5 to 1 with a tier 3 weapon. Other than that, you just have to not die. <laughs> this game this is the perfect prep i've got one of every resource in this room i got a weapon frame and i've got fish if i don't do it on this one i don't know what to say this is a gift i found the dragon so fast as well the vengeance pops a big one let's go this is the one boys and girls this is my fastest prep ever i'm entering the boss room at around 245 i've got plenty of time to kill the boss just don't fuck up Come on, no, not another zero. Another zero, are you joking? Please, I think that's it. I honestly think that's it. I went in on the RNG this time. Yes, 6.11. What? The Grandmaster task has been smashed there. I need a 6.30. And that's where Grandmaster solo missions would have ended, but they added some more tasks. For Sony's nightmare, they added in all of these tasks after the combat achievement release. And it's going to be like this for new bosses. Like a quest cape, you have to get it back. For Sony's nightmare is a solo only version of the nightmare, and it's much harder than the regular version. There is, of course, a speedrun task at 7.30, but I need to get to grips with Fasani's because I haven't done it in a while. And what is my PB looking like? Over 10 minutes. Okay, I completed some easy tasks there. And 2 minutes 30 to knock off of this. That's going to be interesting. I was getting absolutely messed up that round. New PB and the master speed task, but we still need to go under 7.30. There are a bunch of small things I'm doing to save myself time at the nightmare. One of them is pulling up to the pillar so your spell doesn't go through the air for long and it instantly moves on to the next phase. That's the KC task completed, but I was trying to go for the perfect Fasani Nightmare, but it didn't quite work. It's harder than I thought, because the sleepwalkers on the last phase count for hitting the Nightmare. To improve my skills, I'm going to do Can't Wake Up. I've got to kill the Fasani Nightmare five times in its instance without leaving once, which explains this ridiculous inventory. Um, what's this? An egg? A parasitic egg? I think that's for the pet transform, which... 
I don't have the pet, so that's not particularly useful. Five kill trip done and another grandmaster. Can't wake up. Now we're on to the speed run. Fasani speedrunner. We are just under the time there. Three seconds under. They actually had to change this from seven minutes because seven minutes was too hard. All right, I've made it. I've got another shot at the perfect nightmare. I've got to stop all the sleepwalkers from touching Fasani. <laughs> Yes, we've made it. The perfect for Sony Nightmare. I am a Nightmare Grandmaster. And there it is. I've completed all of the Grandmaster solo missions. I'm on 47 Grandmaster tasks in total. Of the ones I've got left, 22 of those are team tasks. And all the rest are 300 hours of kill count. Young Hope, y'all know when the flow is loco. Young B in the R-O-C. Uh-oh, OG, 